smoking and inhaling every moment. It was reckless in the only day. I can see it in your eyes. Hi, lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm so excited for today's video. Today's video is going to be all about my go bag. So, you know how people have like go bags when they're pregnant and they have like all their stuff ready to go in case they have to go to the hospital when their wet breaks. So, I decided I'd make a go bag for my chemo treatments because while I know when I'm going to go to chemo, I never know when I'm going to forget things and I can be very forgetful and leave things behind and I'd rather just have it all in one place just in case I need to go to the hospital in a rush or I have an appointment to be forget about or it gets rescheduled or anything happens. I like to have it all right here in my bag. So, um, so I'm just going to reach in here and pull things out and we're going to see how it goes. Kind of show you what's all in here. So the first thing on top is this little lion that my neighbor Lou gave me. I absolutely love her. Her name is Lou the Lion. Um, I take her with me to all my chemo treatments and um, it's kind of nice just to kind of have something to like squish and hug and love on. So Lou the Lion comes with me to all my treatments and she gives me courage and um, strength and love and just reminds me of my neighbor who is the absolute best person in the world. So I love having that with me. The next thing is this super super cute heart eye mask. Um, I got this um, sent to me by Brooke, who works at Dormify. Um, I will leave a referral link down in case you want 20% off and you want to get uh, this eye mask or some cute stuff for your dorm. Um, I got to work with Dormify and still do as a Dormify representative and ambassador and I absolutely love the brand. Their stuff is so amazing. Um, but it's from Bando, but it sells on Dormify's website. and. It's nice so I want to take a little nap. I have cute little hard eyes now. Look at that emoji. <laughs> Should I like wear them up here for the rest of the video? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. So the next thing in here is this pack of coloring things. Cause I like to keep colors in there to color in some coloring books that friends have given me. And it's always really nice and a fun thing to have. So, gives me lots of colors to choose from. Now, the next thing I have is this coloring book called Color Happy by Pen and Paint. An adult coloring book with removable wall art prints. Page Tate and Co. A family friend of mine um, gave this to me. And I love coloring in it. I have a couple that I've already done that I ripped out and colored or... It just gives you something nice to do when you're in treatment, just kind of very relaxing. Um, but I keep this in there um, just to give me something to do while I'm there because I'm there for some hours. So another thing I keep in there is this Suck It Cancer coloring book that I got from another family friend. I also have some colored pencils in case I want to color with colored pencils in one of the coloring books. Lots of colors, lots of coloring. <laughs> helps soothe me. So I also have, um, I got this from Haya, which is the Huntsman Institute Adolescence and Young Adults Program, um, Cancer Care Program. Um, they gave me this little booklet with Sudoku, Word Search, and Crossword Puzzles in it. Kind of gives you something to do if you don't want to color, um, kind of provoke your brain. Love some crosswords, some Sudoku. Gives you some fun stuff to do. Trust me, it can get really, really boring, so it's, it's nice to have stuff in here to do. Um, now my neighbors. I have some wonderful, wonderful neighbors, um, as I've already told you about Lulu Lion, but the girls on my street. There's a couple, bunch of teenage girls on my street, and they all gave me this really, really cute care package. Classic Puzzles Word Search. It has a bunch of, like, word searches in it, just to keep me busy. Um, I... An average treatment is about four hours, so I get bored of coloring or going through a word search very, very quickly, so having different books and stuff gives me much more variety to work with. So now we're into the fun stuff, like the real stuff. So this is um, a little book that I got from Hadley and Lindsay. 
Um, they both are two amazing women who I really, really look up to and really inspire me. Um, it has my initials on it. I'm holding it upside down, right side up now. Um, HGG, my initials. So the next thing is fluffy socks. I love fuzzy socks. I don't know about you guys, but my feet can get so cold, um, especially since it's winter here, so there's still snow out, and like my fuzzies can get really, really cold. So I like to keep an extra pair of fuzzy socks in case I wear like um, just like thin, sn <laughs> thin socks with sneakers. Um, just having fuzzy socks, taking my shoes off, put my fuzzy socks on, have my little headband, take myself a little nap warm blankies that they have there. Um, it's nice just to have a nice pair of fuzzy socks to put on in case I forget my other socks at home. To always have these in there is really, really nice. I have some snacks. I have some M&M's and a thing of lightly salted peanuts. That was from the snack cart the last time I went. Last time I went, that was from the snack cart. Um, there's a guy that comes around with a little cart with snacks in it. So this right here, it also came with like that little book I showed you. Um, it has my initials on it and it's a little pouch. I like to keep some stuff in here that is like essentials for me. So I keep a little compact mirror just in case, you know, I need to mirror myself. I want to look good sometimes, you know. Um, I keep lip balm and lip scrub in here because my lips get really really chapped and sometimes you don't want to deal with that while you're there. Um, I keep some pens in here just rather for the Sudoku or if I need to fill out paperwork while I'm there or whatever I need to do sometimes. They always have pens but it's nice to have your own so you don't have to wait for them if they forget get a pen. It's just nice to have your own stuff. Um, nice to be prepared you know. And then a thing of Advil um, in case I have like a headache or anything or in case someone with me has one, um, or a visitor that comes to visit me needs any. So the next thing is these super, super cute masks. Um, so they're little like masks that you see people wear in the hospital to keep, like if they cough. Um, but these have, let's see if you can see that. But they're like little disposable masks. Um, so you wear it and then you throw it away. But um, they have little hearts on them, so I don't know if you guys know the Snapchat filters. Um, I'll try to see if I can like, answer a picture here, but if I can't. So they have like the little masks that come up, and then they have like little cat ears, and like they're super super cute. So I took a picture and sent it to my best friend Mallory, and was like, "Oh my gosh, how cute would it be if hospital masks actually looked like this, and they weren't like this just blue like plain color?" I have to wear a lot of these um, if I go out, so I don't get sick or I don't catch other people's germs um so she went online and found these and sent them to me because she was like I want you to have super cute masks and I was like oh my god you're the best oh my goodness you're the best um so she got me these and she got me three different kinds um they all have a little hearts but um, I took this little package and put it in here so I always have cute disposable masks you never know who's gonna be in the hospital thought more stars could happen people my Augustus Waters walks in, I want to be looking good. <laughs> the next thing I have in here is um, just sanitary wipes for your hands. Um, you never really know. It's a hospital. Whether I want to wipe down the seat or want to wipe my hands off. I have like tons of them in here. <laughs> and then I have a like how many pieces are in here? I don't know, like 30 something pack of gum. So I'm never going to run out, and when I do, I can just put them back in here. <laughs> but I have lots of lots of uh, peppermint gum. I'll link my Instagram down below. Give me a follow or DM me, and if you have any questions, comment them down below what you want to see me do a video on next. And I'll see you next time. Mwah.